How about this? Can you pretend to be her? And I'll come in and I'll, and I'll try to talk to you all, all, all romance like. And you did it afterwards. You tell me how I've done it. You okay. really think that would help, Frederick? Yeah, you just, just help me out. Just sit there. Oh, okay. I have an idea. Anything for my brother in law. <laughs> well, hello, Maybelline. Oh, well, hello, Frederick. When I look at you, I feel like a horse. <laughs> how, how was that? Um, well, you know, ladies, we don't, we don't always appreciate the same topics as the men folk. Um, so horses, uh, maybe something more, more ladylike. Ladylike, I got it. Okay. okay, okay, let's try again. <laughs> hello, Maybelline. Oh, hello, Frederick. How you, are you today? You remind me of a heifer. <laughs> well, how's that? Oh, you know, Bradley John Christopher, maybe you should leave it up to him. Yeah, maybe you're right. Now, there's a hot apple pie in the oven with a slice of your name on it to help me trim those hedges. What do you you say? got it! Well, my oh my, Mr. Ruckinson. These are some fine apple trees you have here. Yes, we've been uh, been in the family for a long time. I have something a little special for you. I brought that potion we talked about, free of charge. Free of charge? Why don't you give it a yeah, sip? I'd, I'd love to, but I've got the feeling there's something more to this. <laughs> <laughs> Tastes tart, like an apple. Yes, hopefully it does more than an apple. Well, in about 30 seconds, you can feel a soft thump against your boot as your appendage <laughs> falls clean off. <laughs> What'd you do to me? You don't recognize me, do you, Mr. Ruffinson? <laughs> <laughs> you never thought I'd see you again. That's right. You don't even remember my name, do you? No, None of the people in this town do. Before, before Polytown was Polytown. It was Monotown. It was Monotown. <laughs> I was the one who turned into Polytown. <laughs> now let me see. <laughs> I just heard the thump against it. <laughs> Why'd you come back? I came back to get my revenge. You see, when I was young, I was an ugly boy. You're still an ugly boy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you dare say that, sir. But it was my idea to start a web of love. I wanted to ask every single person in Pirate Town to create a web of love. <laughs> like a spy, snatching those spies in my way. But oh no, they all denied me. And now I have come for my revenge, selling my potions to infertilize all of them. <laughs> all of them who mocked me, starting with you. The Polytown has thrived in your absence, and now you're coming back to ruin it. You're the one who wanted it to be Polytown. Tell me you're making it monotown again, or even less. <laughs> <laughs> I want to turn it into my own town, Unix. <laughs> All of you will be at my knees, saying sorry, sorry, little old Billy that we said no to you so many years ago, and I'm just going to laugh. What's it going to cost? Do you have an antidote? Do you have something? What's it going to cost? There ain't no antidote for losing your wit. <laughs> <laughs> That's just so new. I got to go. <laughs> oh, my darling. I just don't know how much longer I can wait for a baby. Well, Every day it gets harder. I see those girls that I went to school with. They all have Six or seven children to help them on the farm, and I, oh. I, think, I think that might be the answer to our prayers. <coughs> I hope 
himself. Who is oh, it? Maybelline. Oh, Maybelline. <laughs> oh, darling, don't put that look on your face. Hi, Maybelline. Hello. Come on in the kitchen. <laughs> I have to say, I'm, I'm a bit nervous. Yeah, you look pretty sweaty. <laughs> things up, mm -hmm. and I thought I'd add my own spouse. Right. There he is. <laughs> Third glass of water? <laughs> I, th I think we're going to need something a little bit stronger. A, a pitcher of whiskey. A pitcher of whiskey. <laughs> well. This is Dr. Parnassus. Oh, hello, sir. Dr. Parnassus. Oh, the doctor. That's oh, a firm handshake you got there. Oh, and I saw the only thing that's going to be firm. I'm Miss Delilah, and I've heard that you can help me and my husband. We're trying to conceive a baby. Oh. Not only is he a master of fertility, but he is also a master of love. Oh. Now, you don't mind if I lay out my wares on this here table of yours? Oh, my God. I have an abundance of potions, if you'd like to give him a sample. Why this one? Make the baby <laughs> pop right at you. Oh, that there's more penis, isn't it? You have a keen eye, sir. <laughs> My God, I'm so much bigger than I thought I'd be. Well, he was a big one. But uh, you swallow that, it'd give you the strength of a pig. Me <laughs> swallow that? Oh, but Doc. I can handle it. <laughs> ever, since, ever since all our cows died, we don't have much money. And these potions look awfully fancy and expensive. Well, you know, usually I, I charge an arm and a leg for all of these wonderful potent <coughs> potions. But you know, I could be persuaded on a hot day like this to give you some free samples if you'd like to give them a sip. Oh, well, yeah. Well, let's. I'm kind of. Go on. I think we need to hear more. <clears throat> yeah. Well, I just think that you really enjoy them. Brad and John. John. Brad and John Christopher. Christopher. <laughs> I know, my daddy then gave me three names. He couldn't decide between them. So we figured, why not all three? He's so much a man, he needs three names. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I know you are. Now, you look a little familiar to me. Didn't you say you ain't from around these parts? I didn't say that. You know what? You probably just got one of them faces. Joe! <laughs> Joe! Right. Joe, tonight's tonight. I'm going to go over to Maybelline's place and confess my love to her. Can I get something from the box shelf? Oh, Frederick, get your ass out of Get out from behind my bar. The <laughs> <laughs> nerve of you, Christopher. <laughs> I need a little liquid courage here. Well, liquid courage is what we've got. You've got it on tap, you've got it on bottom shelf, middle shelf, and top shelf. There you go. I see that doctor up in town, and a lot of people going on to visit him. He done make house calls now? Yeah, I heard Barnassus, he is not one to shy away from going into the home and helping with whatever issues they might have, be they private or public. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, I hope I won't be into his services. I want, I want to be a strong man, mind, body, and soul, on my own. No, no help in medicine. No help? Yeah. I reckon you might have that in you. You see, this right here, bottom shelf liquor, Stronger and more fearsome and brave than any soldier you've ever seen. I get your refill. Hey, Joe. Hello. Oh, oh, hey there, Dangling. Table. <laughs> you, you, you 
Finish up this here tale. 